Hey to a new studio vlog! I received some new washi tapes some weeks ago and I'm so happy how they turned out. I found another supplier and I'm super happy with the quality, I think it's even better now. And yeah, please tell me which one is your favorite, I'm really curious about that. I'm really blown away by your support, last week's I got a lot of orders, which I'm so thankful for. This order was my biggest order ever, like just look at it. I'm also super happy that some people bought these earrings in the last weeks, because they are not as popular in my shop. And actually same with my tarot cards. And by the way I got a lot of questions if I could do a whole tarot deck. And I really want to do that, it's definitely on my list, but at the moment I really don't have time for that. So yeah, I will definitely keep you updated on this topic. The Pesto Witch washi tape really has to be my favorite. I just love the colors and the stars and it looks so witchy, I'm really in love. This month's Patreon theme is Winter Witch and I went for a blue color scheme which I think is perfect. I really love creating all those products to a different theme every month because it really inspires me and I can't believe that I already have over 30 patrons. This is so surreal to me but of course makes me really really happy. When it comes to my themes, I always want it special and really specific so I can make really creative things out of it. So for example, I would never do just a theme witch or something like that because I could literally do anything, but this would get really boring after some time. So yeah, I really love the idea of making really specific themes, so I have to be creative and think of what I can do in this theme and would fit the best. I've already posted a poll on Patreon on which my patrons could decide which Patreon theme should be the next and it literally took me hours to come up with these ideas because I really, as I said, wanted specific and this takes me a lot of time and research. I don't know why, but the Winter Witch theme came instantly to my mind when I thought about December. Even though I'm not a big Christmas or winter person at all, but I really wanted to make it a little bit extra special for this month. So I decided to add a holographic sticker and a bookmark with tassel, which you will see in a bit. I had to make a lot of sticker sheets and I had some problems with my silhouette, which is super annoying but that's a part of having a small business, there are always things that can go wrong. The whole process of making all of these patron rewards took me literally two whole days. I really was a little bit overwhelmed by the amount of things I had to do. Even for a big shop update I wouldn't make such a big amount of products. I really try to make everything as environment friendly as possible so I don't make huge amounts of products at first because if they wouldn't sell well it would be just a waste and I rather restock things which is kind of an advantage if you make your products at home. And it's also really time consuming and especially when you want to pack orders and you realize you run out of things, it's really annoying. But I really wanted to make it a thing that I have like a restock day every week. So order packing will be a lot quicker.
If you don't know, I always have a story behind my characters. I really love the idea and makes me really creative thinking of what this character actually would do and how the personality would be. And so much fun creating fantasy worlds and their characters and imagining living in their world. I plan to do snowflake confetti for this month's old male and happy snail, but it failed. So no self-made confetti this time. But yeah, let me show you which products are in the old mail this month. We have this winter witch sticker sheet, then this print of my character starlet, and oh my gosh, I'm so obsessed with the printing quality. Then we have my fourth character card. It's really unbelievable how time flies, like how is this my fourth month on Patreon? Then we have my special holographic snowflake sticker, which didn't turn out perfectly in my opinion. Because of the cutting process, there's a little bit white dust on it, but I guess you barely can see it. And this is my favorite out of all these products, my white oval cold snow. And last but not least, we have this bookmark with tassel, which is double-sided. And I'm using these blue envelopes. And side note, in my happy snail tier, you can also just get the sticker sheet and the two die-cut stickers. I always have two shipping dates for my Patreon mail, so first one is in the middle of the month and the second one is at the beginning of the next month. Because of that, people can join the whole month and also get the specific goodies they joined for. So you can still join till the end of December to get all of these goodies you see here. What I'm really happy about is that I can lower my price of my Patreon mails because of the fact that more people can join and get the exact same goodies. So compared to similar products in my shop, the Old Mail or Happy Snail is cheaper and of course exclusive. Plus you will receive a lot of digital content on my Patreon and even Etsy discount codes. Some people over on TikTok and Instagram ask me if this is my full-time job and if I make money with YouTube. And I thought I could talk a little bit about this now. So YouTube is just a hobby for me. Obviously, I don't have that many followers. And YouTube is not my biggest priority at the moment because editing videos takes a lot of time. And I also have to edit an exclusive video for my patrons every single month. But I can't complain about my Etsy and Patreon incomes, especially in the last months. But when I think about summer, I'm a little bit afraid of it because sale-wise summer will be slower, I guess. But I just keep going no matter what. I highly appreciate your support and it really means so so much to me. So that's it with today's video. I hope you enjoyed watching it. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and comment. See you next time. Bye!